one flesh, one love. I miss it real. That's what. Uh, baby, you are driving me crazy. Baby, driving me crazy. You're an angel sent from above, sent into a dark pit to pull me up. Girl, you don't know everything you did for me. So I gotta pour it out on this track of you breathe That's how much I love you, baby, can't you see? Baby, you got me madly and crazy In love with you So much love is so true It's so pure It ain't blue I ain't blue No more No more Are you better than Bruce? Because God gave me you And God gave you me too Baby, driving me crazy Yeah, yeah Baby, you driving me crazy With this love you gave me Praise the Lord from above Who gave us Each other We better thank God Fathers and mothers I'm thankful for your father and mother I know you're thankful for my father and mother Baby Baby driving me crazy so madly in love with you, I know it's true. I'm ready to have you. I'm ready for you right now. Even though the distance separating us, God bringing us together. Like the distance don't matter, baby. I know you see it too. It is just so beautiful and it ain't blue and now I'm happy too so happy to just have you ooh baby things you do to me drive me crazy and we ain't even met yet just imagine when we meet what it's gonna be like in the sheets girl you are my world I said, girl, you are, you are my world, you've been driving me crazy, baby, with this love, for so long, it feels like years, but it's only been months, can't you see the tears that I'm pouring out on this track, from my heart and soul, just for you, baby, cause I know, we're healing and bending each other from those blues The past is behind us, girl You know it's true I was meant for you You was meant for me And we're never gonna be blue again Not gonna live in sin God, get it here so we can let the marriage begin that's what's up, fellas and ladies out there, don't think that you ain't got a special lady or a special man, just like my baby told me, I, she was my missing rib, and I believe that, and she's coming to my crib, I believe that, too. Cause God told me this too He said son I need you to move I need you to prepare for a wife and children too Talk about the happiness That that brings When it starts to come true Moving on Just for you Moving on Just for you 
Fellas and ladies, they got a special one for you too. That's the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. They got a missing ripper, you fellas. So you better watch out, like my baby says. The one that's driving me crazy. Okay, guys. This all started with their 13-year love story began with her accidentally texting him a Bible verse. Accidentally. Cannot wait to hear this. This is going to be beautiful and amazing. I, let me tell you, Sam fan, I have been savoring our next story. It's just a good one. Did you know 50% of all Americans are not married? 50%, half of us. That's true, right? According to the latest census, there are 126.9 million single people walking around. Okay. Some by choice, some not by choice, but we'll talk about that later. Not all of them are looking for love, but many people, let's face it, are. And when you're looking and you're not finding, it's easy to lose hope. That's real talk. But my next guest, incredible story of finding love in the most unlikely way, will have romantic hopefuls checking their phones. Take a look. In 2009, Brenda Rivera started her work day like any other. I was getting ready to open up the office to start the day, and I had a little bit of time, so I was putting the scripture text on my phone, and then the office phone rang, so I put my phone away and totally forgot about this text message. Later that day, I came home and I'm like, oh, I was supposed to send this text. I should probably send it now. 30 minutes later, I get a text message back. This person replied, amen to that, who is this? Which I replied, it's Brenda, Roxy's sister. And he said, uh, no, I don't think we've ever met. But by your text, I can see that you love God. That's awesome. The man on the other line was a stranger named Isaiah, who just gotten that new phone number that day. I was like, oh my goodness, I am so sorry. I did not mean to send this text to you. He's like, oh, no worries, you know, not a big deal. He asked if he could call me sometime, and I said yes. The two began sharing phone conversations, and that led to a whirlwind love story. Fast forward to 2023, and Brenda and Isaiah have been married for almost 13 years and have six kids. Praise the Lord, look at that, 13 years and 6 kids, if that ain't a blessing, I don't know what it is, y'all, this is beautiful. Story on TikTok, and it went viral, with over 2.8 million views, their story making headlines worldwide. It's a blessing. Thank God for people like this, Lord, I, I'm telling you, I, you this story it. takes me out every time. It does it seem Jesus as name. unreal to you now, even though you've lived it for 13 years? Absolutely. Yeah, yes. it, yeah every time I think about it. It's yeah. like something out of a movie. It <laughs> is like a, so, Brenda, there you go. You're, you're texting this scripture. Mm -hmm. You've called it divine intervention in some ways that it would go to Isaiah. The scripture was a Bible verse from Philippians um, 2, and it says, Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit, rather in humility, value others above yourself, not looking to your own interests, but each of you to the interests of the others. Amen. So Beautiful. Beautiful. What was going on in your life that that's what you wanted to share with someone? I've always been like wanting to focus more on other people. I see my life as like, I'm supposed to be a blessing to others, not looking what's gonna be a blessing for me. And I had the habit of sending- Amen, sister. Thank you. <laughs> of sending like either an inspirational text or a Bible verse or just something positive to my contacts. And that day, that's what I chose to send. So fast forward now, how many children? Six. You have six kids. Yeah, three girls, three boys. Three girls, three boys. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, from a wrong text message. The right text message. The right, yeah. the right text message. What does it feel to have your life aligned in this way? Amazing. Uh, uh, just seeing how God has led in the past before we even met all the different way marks he's led each of us in our own personal lives and then how we met 
And then even after we've been married, all the different things he's, he's done in our lives, it just blows our minds. Right. When we stop, yeah. stop for a minute and just <sighs> take a step back and look and see, it's just amazing. It is. Half of the country is single. There are people out there who may not want to fall in love, but when you want it, and it comes in this unexpected, beautiful way, you should share this story. Mm -hmm. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lay down in green pastures. He leadeth me by the still waters. He prepareth a table for me in the midst of mine enemies. Yea, I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I shall fear no evil, because thou art with me. Amen. And I'm happy you've done that. You. Now, I know you've celebrated your 13th marriage anniversary this June, and so we wanted to gift you something because I think people need to hear this story. Yeah. And so you got six little ones. You deserve <laughs> a little time alone together, and we wanted to give you a little trip. So here we go. <laughs> Here we go. We want you to enjoy the northern tip of Isle of Palms. Take a look at this. It's nestled on the lush barrier island off the coast of South Carolina. You will find the beloved Wild Dunes Resort spanning over 1,500 acres of oak. This is good show right here, guys. There need to be shows more like this on TV. Family friendly loving shows like this and america will turn around and get the bible back in the schools and it will turn around and the lord will lift us high he will lift us up lord the lord will lift us out of this darkness come on y'all you know you want this so i asked you to pray for it Seek, and ye shall find. Ask, and ye shall receive. So that means you ask for the person that you really want. Okay? And you will get them as long as you keep looking. You can't give up. You can't give up. Because, guys, I was on the verge of giving up. Like, I even said to myself, if this don't work, I'm going to give up. And I didn't. And that was because the Lord strengthened me. That's all credit due to Him. And every day I live is all credit due to Him. That's the truth. It's a sin every day. I thank God for Jesus and repentance. I thank God for a beautiful woman who loves me. For who I am. And my faults don't matter. And that's beautiful. When someone loves you when you're for even when they know your faults. Okay? It's a beautiful thing. Oceanfront Paradise. It has a variety of accommodations, including the new coastal modern sweet grass inn. Together, you can play 36 holes of golf at the Tom Fazio Design Championship course. Visit their world-class spa, on-site art gallery, resort, pool, tennis court, relax at the restaurant and bar. Wild dudes, our friends over there were so inspired by your story. The result is offering you a little something for everyone. So. Brenda, you guys are going to get your six-night romantic getaway worth $4,200. Yes. <laughs> because, like I said, for, for, for me, I have chosen to share my faith journey. Faith is personal. What you believe is personal. That said, it is okay to share your faith. And it is safe to share your faith. And you in that response, like, listen, I like that you like God too. That was the right answer. Yeah. And we appreciate you inspiring people. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. So enjoy. You got all this time. Thank you. The only thing that our friends at Wild Dunes Resort did not provide is a babysitter for those six <laughs> children. So you're on your own there. Yeah. You're yeah. on yeah. your own. Brenda yeah. and Isaiah, yeah. thank you so thank much. You. Our friends thank at Wild Dunes Resort, you. thank you so much. Okay, guys, so 
I hope you enjoyed that. It surely was something. I am sorry for uh, the interruptions there. Um, pray for me. Anyway, God bless you guys. I hope you enjoyed the show. It's a special one. And it's going to be called, this is Jay Bizzle Show, How to Find True Love. God bless you, brothers and sisters. And those of you who don't know Jesus Christ, the greatest love story ever told is this one. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. For whosoever believeth in him shall not perish but shall have everlasting life to die on an old rugged cross and he's God and he knew it what had to happen. He done that for you and for me. So before we close this show, I'm going to pray real quick. Lord, save some people. In Jesus' name, I ask this thing. Lord, save them. Save them from the pits of hell. Amen. Oh, this has been the Jay Bizzle Show. God bless. We'll see you Monday.